we'll start here with respect it or check it, right? Uh, the context of the story is the same. I heard it earlier in the week, but forgot where I heard it from. But the context of the story is accurate. So regardless if like the numbers are like verbatim or not, I heard this on on, on the Breakfast Club, right? Respect it or check it. Son, uh, father gives his son a hundred dollars to flip on FanDuel, making bets, right? However, at the start of the son trying to turn this hundred into multiple thousands. He loses like 50 out the gate. So immediately after giving the son a hundred dollars, the dad, like the next day is just like, yo, like, did we hit last night? Like, what, what, what are we doing? And it's uh, like, nah, man, nah, I lost parlay with the, ooh, like I lost the 50. And right then and there, immediately the, the father was just like, oh, the hell with it, man, I'm done with you. You making me think you about to cash this out if I give you this hundred. Like, man, ain't nobody worried about them funky-ass bitch you call yourself doing. So the son, like, all right, Pops, it is what it is. It's cool. Later on, with $50 left, that son turns that $50 he had into, like, 5200 $5, Why don't we, right? <laughs> so the son geeked, hyped off, uh, hitting for the 5200 Uh. The dad is like, oh, word, bet, bet, bet. That's what's up. We here for 5,200. 50, and the son's like, what you mean, we? You told me, you told me that I lost that first. <laughs> you told me that I lost that 50. Like, you weren't really rocking with me no more. Like, what you mean, we? And so, uh, so that is how the story unfolds. Uh, <laughs> like, on the, on the Breakfast Club, I think it's called, like, get it off your chest or, like, tell us why you're mad. Uh -huh. And so the father called in to the radio station and, like, that's why he was mad. Trying to get that off his chest, like my my damn son. I gave him a hundred dollars. He turned it into fifty two hundred, and then act like he don't want to split the profits with me just because I, I I checked out on him after after he lost the very first bet. Uh, respect it or check it. The son not being willing to split those profits with his pops, who he got the <clears throat> initial seed investment with. Considering the pops wrote him off for dead after his first loss, you gotta check it. Me <laughs> go ahead, today. I see Isaac face, but go I mean, ahead. I mean, I guess <laughs> literally just at least the hundred dollars or whatever the hundred plus whatever interest you want to put on it for the initial investment, and that's it. That's the only reason I check it. I don't think that there should be no percentage splits. I think if anything, you know, he should receive 100% of his investment, which is the $100 and whatever I put on top, you know, just for you looking out whenever, whenever I need you to look out. Because without your money, I don't have the opportunity to do this. So I at least gotta make you square and then we good. But if I made 5,200, like you may see 200. Damn. Respect uh, it and check it is a. I don't have no choice but to respect that, but I probably would have went about it a little differently. Uh, I definitely would have gave him the original investment amount back for sure, hands down. <laughs> because without you, we not in this. I'm not in this position. However, on top of that. Anything extra is literally just that, unless we had some type of agreement, right? Like, and see, that's where it, that's where it gets tricky to me. Like, see, mm -hmm. family and being business, right? Because when you start putting money into it, it just has an opportunity to get ugly, right? Because who's to say I don't win anything, right? Are you looking for that original hundred dollars back? You're not looking for anything else afterwards, right? But contingent on me winning, do I owe you half? Am I am I obligated to? You know what I mean? Like, what 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 are we? What's the what's the law there? So I just feel like the moral compass takes over a little bit there, and it's like, okay, definitely, I just want 
you know, 5,200. Man, I'm not going to lie to you. That 200 is yours for sure. Like, and I ain't going to lie, just for being my dad type shit, like, <laughs> I would give you, I'd probably give you a band. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, we're going to ball. We're going to ball. Uh, but the the whole, I, I think the where it starts to turn, you know, is the complete disbelief or the faith, oh, ye of little faith, right? That just got the going after I didn't win the first night. And that probably would have pissed me off a little bit. And I would have been like, you know what, man, I, I appreciate you. Um, but, you know, your faith, the size of a mustard seed, wasn't really <laughs> mustard seed like that. So what I'm going to do is, first off, I wouldn't have told him how much. I mean, like, I did win some money. <laughs> exactly. Here's this. Yeah, God exactly. bless you. Let I love bless. you. <laughs> I hit for that 200. If you need me, call me. Or send me it's another your, 100. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? No, don't send me shit. I'm cool. Yeah, no, no, I'm done with you. <laughs> but, like, you know, we, we off and running now. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah, what, what, what my boy said, um, yeah, it it is tricky because, like you, you wrote me off type ish. Like really, right there, I'm supposed to just take this hundred as a whole blessing at that point. When you like, ah, you wasting my time. Okay, now the hundred is a blessing. So whatever I do with it, I I thank you for blessing me in the time where I needed you. But now I'm up, so it, it is what it is. Now if you be like, hey yo. Remember that one time I blessed you. If you can, you know, say hold me down, I appreciate it. And then yeah, but that's until you ask. Other than that, I'm gonna just have to take it as a blessing. Especially with you doubting me, with you doubting me. Now you just became a naysayer and a hater for me. Now I gotta prove you wrong with y'all, your own hundred dollars. You, you're lucky I don't give you the fifty back. You'd be like, man, before I lose this, I just want to go ahead give your money back. Sitting on the whole 5,000. You don't even know. Yeah. Nah, man. Um, that's a good respect to the check it. Uh, now, nah, when I first heard it, I, I really couldn't help but die laughing. Um, I would have I would have kind of played uh, the guard role in this sense. Like, I'm going to bless you to the extent of what your faith allows you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good. That's, that's a go. You know what I'm saying? And, and nothing more, nothing less. That's a good way. So that that's what I'm saying. I'm like, way. really, the thousand is really shake down, like, press, press together, <laughs> together and, like, and no. run it over. Yeah, the two hundred I think is more than enough. You got double your investment, bro. You yeah. made out like well. that's a that's a win in any <laughs> that's market. A win. That's a win in any exactly. So. Yeah, man. But that five thousand, you know, thank you to Yahweh. Yeah, <laughs> we gonna hallelujah. build off that. Hallelujah, and keep going. 